All right, so this is the entrance to Isagon Hills, or what is the name of the property? So fam, we're gonna get you inside if you see this thing here. But yes, we're in Isagon Hills, and this is one of these incredible, beautiful estates that is serviceable. All finished. Uh -huh. Getting to the hill. Paperwork and all those things, ready to go. Oh, you're right. You are on a hill for real. So, this is the highest hill. But then we get down over there. You see all the way to the airport. Then you see the Agricola Tamaho right from here. Fam, we can see everything, family. We're going to get out and show you some more. Family, what a beautiful tropical day in my favorite country in the world, Ghana, West Africa. And we are literally in Isagon, in an area now called Isagon Hills. And I see why it's called Isagon Hills. It's a little bit up in elevation from where we are in uh, Isagon at the Miklin Hotel. Uh, so, there's some good brothers here. This is part of uh, my collection or connection with our, our good brother, Dr. Milana, as he introduced me to a nice building group. That way we can be able to just uh, work and showcase something more developed and available and ready for those who want to just literally start making some moving. Basically for people who want property in the prime area versus where we are in the prime rural area, because that's going to be the future. But uh, you know me, I'm all about options for us. That's from the desk because those of us coming are going to have different ideas, different feel of what we're looking to do. Yeah. Some may want to join directly with a community group and some may want to join with just a general group. So we're going to spit out all the options for you and we're going to make it work. So this is a nice beautiful wall. Yeah. And then the production of work will just go on in here, you know. So from what you see, ground up from the dirt, to walls being put in, to buildings being up. And it's all a part of that opportunity to be a part of the future of Africa. I'm hoping to get some numbers and everything because I'm sure people want to ask me. How much is the cost of plots of land and getting homes built? Yeah. When I can tell you what I know from what we have there in our Black Star Pan-African community, uh, which is not going to be the same price as this because you're right here in one of the most ridiculously expensive neighborhood in Ghana, East Ogon, and look at that view. Yeah. So this community and this project give you a chance to get into the game and you know get you a resident here yeah. what I usually do for myself is just usually make my bookings at the Micklin Hotel in Accra and I put me in the neighborhood yeah so but yes it'll be lovely to own a nice apartment complex you know and run some business as operation out of it And as usual, any details we get, we're gonna put it together. That's what we were riding in. Toyota Tundra. That's the kind of truck you need if you're gonna be making your way around certain parts. And as you can see, this is a nice wall built around the entire area. I'm also going to find out the acreage and everything. And if nothing else, family, what I will do is make sure we put it in description, comments, and share with you web links and things like that. 
and I'm not only pushing my own project with my built my uh, community group but also working with other people <laughs> family I'm just like this is this this beauty right here So I'm gonna do my best to get some explanation of everything that we're looking at that I'm showing you this uh, raw and uncut up front. But as you can see, the foundation of the area has been built. 